Crocodilians are some of the most diverse and unique reptiles the planet has ever known. Yet, to most, crocodilians are basically a single animal in two flavors, crocs and gators. This simplistic view of these reptiles does no justice to their fascinating evolutionary story. Crocodilians are Pseudosuchians, a group of archosaurs that appeared before the Jurassic period, but the Triassic-Jurassic extinction event gave them their shot for great diversification. Although the lineages that exist into the present include animals that mostly live similar carnivorous lifestyles, crocodilians once included everything from insectivorous animals to, believe it or not, herbivorous animals, as in the Notosuchian line, animals which resembled the armored dinosaurs of the later Cretaceous period. Today, saltwater crocodiles often travel far out to sea, but they are still, technically speaking, land animals. However, in the Jurassic, crocodilians truly became masters of the sea. Metriorhynchus was a crocodilian completely adapted to life in the Jurassic oceans, likely feeding on ichthyosaurs, fish, turtles, and anything else it could catch. The Jurassic was a golden age for reptiles, not just dinosaurs. The archosaur line dominated the land, and it even colonized the oceans. For millions of years, crocodilians lived diverse lifestyles, feeding on flesh or plants. The common myth that crocodilians are prehistoric relics, unchanged since the Mesozoic, couldn't be more false. These are not evolutionary throwbacks, especially considering what we would commonly recognize as a crocodile didn't evolve until later into the Cretaceous period. Just like the dinosaurs and every other animal on our planet, crocodilians are varied and carry with them a long evolutionary history, beginning with the Protosuchians in the Triassic and early Jurassic, the Mesosuchians, which conquered the oceans, and then the more familiar Eosuchians, which persist to this day. Crocodilians demonstrate their adaptability, their, at times, staggering diversity, and their equal standing with the dinosaurian cousins that they lived alongside.